Hello, and welcome to Japanese Craft Beer Reviews. From today, we're going to begin looking at a whole series of beers from a brewery that we haven't touched on yet, and that brewery is called Baron. And Baron is a brewery in northern Japan in the city of Morioka, Iwate Ken, Iwate Prefecture. And they have been around since 2001. Uh, that was when they were founded. And they uh, are a kind of specialist in German style beers. And they make a variety of those types of beers. And uh, uh, we will look at several of them. Uh, Baron, uh, their name means bear in German and or it's actually the the uh, genitive the uh, uh, possessive form or plural form of bear and they do have a bear on their label and this bear is also uh, standing over a barrel with uh, three traditional beer making tools uh, so uh, very traditional old style European beer making tools. And uh, Baron, their original equipment they bought from Germany and reports are that some of the equipment they bought was actually over 100 years old. Um, and I'm not sure how much of that still exists. Uh, they are uh, a fairly large brewery. They're considered a microbrewery though, but they are pretty big um, and they uh, make uh, several beers every every year. Uh, they have three regulars. Uh, those regulars are their classic beer, which is the first one we will look at, the Baron Classic, which is a Dortmunder style, and a Schwartz beer, and an Alt. So those are their three mainstay beers, but they also make a variety of seasonals uh, throughout the year, and uh, we'll look at uh, uh, about nine of them and mainly German styles. They do produce a variety of others uh, as well, but mainly German styles, and they're famous for that in Japan. Uh, German style beer is, uh, has a kind of special place in Japan because the original breweries back in the 1800s were uh, staffed or originated by uh, Euro Europeans and especially Germans. And uh, Baron also uses a lot of German ingredients that they import from Germany. Um, and one point about their beers is that uh, while their, their bottled beers are pasteurized uh, to allow them to be shipped you know, around the country, uh, their draft beer is not. So if you go to their uh, uh, restaurant in Morioka, you can drink uh, unpasteurized fresh Baron beer. On Rate Beer, uh, Rate Beer lists 104 different beers, individual beers from them, and Untapped has 131, and the Untapped average score is 3.54, a little bit high. So we're going to look at uh, 12 different beers uh, from them, and we will start with their three uh, class, the, the three main beers: the Classic, the Schwartz, and the Alt. And let's get going, shall we? Oh, by the way, the bear, the bear that they use as their on their logo uh, is also the official uh, prefectural animal of Iwate Ken, way up in northern Japan, an area where you might come across a bear in the forest. All right, and we have another beer from Baron, and uh, this is among the final ones we'll do. And this is called Baron Kobiru Beer. And it's a Saison at 6.5%, uh, so a little jump in alcohol. And uh, it says uh, special QK for you. QK means uh, a break or a rest period, uh, and apparently, in the dialect of Japanese that's used in Iwate Prefecture, way up north, uh, Kobiru means the same thing, a kind of short break uh, or a rest from farm work. And 
Uh, this, of course, connects to the origins of Cezanne uh, in Belgium. Uh, as a summer drink, Cezanne is the season, and the season here is definitely uh, summer. Uh, so uh, a refreshing summer drink, uh, maybe during work or after work, after hard farm work in uh, the fields. So, okay, 6.5%. This beer has uh, two ratings on rate beer only, uh, 3.4 out of 5, and uh, un untapped 64 ratings at 3.69. So, so reasonable ratings for sure. Uh, on their web website, they call it a wit beer saison or a wit beer. So, it uh, has uh, wheat, which is grown in Iwate Prefecture, and it's also unfiltered. So, the uh, ingredients include barley malt, uh, wheat uh, malt, and uh, and hops. So there's. The Whitbeer name implies it probably should have some kind of uh, 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 coriander or something like that, some sort of spice to it. Uh, I'm kind of guessing maybe they mean it's simply just a wheat beer rather than a wit beer or a white beer. Let's give it a go. 6.5% Saison. I've been very happy with the beers I've had in this series from uh, Baron. Uh, they make German styles very well, and here they are attempting a saison. Okay, so it is a very, very hazy, not quite cloudy, but hazy. You can see through it, but uh, kind of hazy sort of dark pastel yellow uh, with a very fluffy two plus fingers of white chunky foam. And through the light it Okay. All right, and aroma. Mm, yeah, definitely has a Definitely has saison yeast, light, sort of spritzy, mild, citrusy sort of note. Mm. And I do get kind of the, the wheat beer note as well. Okay, all right, it is uh, kind of heavy heavy sort of saison. Kind of a sort of dark fruitiness, not dark fruit, but uh, kind of slightly heavy stone fruitiness, uh, mild bittering. Uh, this is pleasant. This would sustain you in the fields on a hot day, I'm sure. Uh, uh, yeah, it's uh, it's it's competently made. I think it doesn't really uh, stand out in any one aspect. It does have the the yeastiness. It has the mild bitterness from mid palate on, uh, and a sort of sustained fruitiness uh, that carries through into the finish. Um, very pleasantly pleasant made uh, pleasant beer, but not really, uh, not really uh, knocking me out in any sense here. It's not as crisp uh, and clean as many saisons are. It's a little bit heavy and overloaded, uh, with a kind of deep fruitiness uh, to be really kind of satisfying as a saison. But it's not bad at all. Uh, nice for a little break. Again, this is called uh, Baron uh, Kobiru beer. It's a saison at 6.5%. Uh, and it has a bear here who is relaxing. Of course, Baron is, uh, means bear in German. And uh, bear is on their, their uh, logo as well. Okay, give this a go. And uh, please let me know what you think. Send me a comment. And 
please subscribe to the channel. Uh, we're just about done here with Baron beers, and we're going to move on to uh, uh, some uh, wheat beers in our next series. And uh, uh, looking forward to a lot of new other new beers. I've got some beers from uh, uh, Second Story Air Ale Works on the way, and I'm looking forward to those. So uh, subscribe to the channel, and let's uh, let's do this together. All right, take care. Bye bye.